We were in third place, but the vehicle that was slightly in front of us turned the longer way. So we're hoping we're gonna get into Outlook faster than they are. Fingers crossed! <laughs> Fingers crossed! This is like so intense and so exciting. Oh, I can't handle this. Outlook Saskatchewan! Wow. <laughs> sure, Lisa. All right, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Teams must make their way to the Dakota Dunes Golf Links located on the Whitecaps First Nation to complete an alternate shot, chip, and putt challenge. Teams will decide on which member will chip onto green, and then their partner will putt for birdie. Oh boy. If they miss their putt, the team member who chipped has a chance to drop in the cup to receive the next cover. Be careful, your team does not get ball in three shots. We'll have to start over. Oh boy. Okay. Ready? And then we have to head to the casino to receive our next cover. Oh yeah, the clocks are wrong, that's why. Oh fuck. You got it? You're reading it? Yeah, okay. That's a long one. Rip it! Rip it good! Oh, oh. litter. make their way to the Dakota Dunes Golf Links located on the White Cap First Nation. Okay, that's good. Let's go. We know where we're going. Okay. I'll read in the car. Let's go. Things are ace, day two. Okay. So, make our way to Dakota Dunes Golf Links located on the White Cap First Nation to compete in an alternate shot, chip, and putt challenge. Awesome! Oh man, I'm not good at golfing. <laughs> I'm not great we're gonna either. have to try a few times, I think. What it's is okay. a what is a birdie? Uh, one under par. Okay. Be careful! If your team does not get the ball in the hole in three shots, you'll have to start over. Once you have completed this task, you must then head to the D Dakota Dunes Casino to receive your next clue. Good luck. So there's no actually you don't have to actually drive it, you just have to yeah. chip. Yeah. Okay. Well I can kind of chip. Good, with my gloves. Because so. I can. Right on. Honey. Woo! I love golfing. <laughs> so what did you guys think of yesterday? How do you think yesterday went? Uh I think it all went alright. Made a couple mistakes, but I think overall it was a pretty fun day. Pretty good. So yesterday, I think both of us were feeling like we were on a bit of an emotional roller coaster just because we were moving around in the placing quite a bit, uh, chasing for first. So we started the day off in second, but we had been in third and fourth and second yesterday, so it's kind of all over the place, but it was super, super fun. Uh, I'd never shot a gun before, so that was really cool for me. <laughs> Tenille's a pro star, so she was good. And then uh, Sandcastles was a bit of a, a Gong show. A gong show just because show. we didn't fully quite understand the, the clue, but that was okay. We took a little bit of a penalty, but then we came back up in a second, so that's okay. We're good. Pulled through. Pulled through. Pulled through. So yesterday was pretty intense. It was a tight competition. There was only a matter of minutes between us and the other teams, but we managed to keep the lead. Um, it's been pretty fun so far. Oh dear. It was well, a challenging day. We started out with the <laughs> skeet shooting and we were come out of their last place, so. We uh, were a little down on ourselves, but uh, once we started getting on the road, and then we took a couple wrong turns, so we were kind of pulling up the tail end. We did manage to get into second place, took another wrong turn, <laughs> and uh, ended up in third, but we're only 20 minutes out of first, so we're, uh, we're thinking we're doing okay. And how do you guys uh, feel about the way they set it all up? Fabulous. Oh, I think it's an excellent, excellent job, yeah. well done by everyone. She's been good, good people, met some good people already, and the uh, Rosetown boys and girls are awesome. We are hoping today to crush first place and crush them, crush them, get into first place and hold a solid lead by the end of the day. 
Hopefully. <laughs> Fingers crossed. <laughs> Cheers on. Good luck. I'll come and try and help you. Cut that twice and don't run in your line. This way, so you want to aim on this side of the pin. But not too hard. Okay, so you see how it rolls like yeah. that? It alternates? Yeah. So she did the first putt yeah. and I do the next one? Okay. Oh, you Teams must now make their way to Blue Mountain Adventure Park, located north of North Battleford, to receive their next clue. We hope you're unafraid of heights. Let's go! Oh dear, go Lisa, get a putter! Well, where do I get a putter Where's from? Your Take your time, tap it in. Okay. Let's go! Thanks, guys! <laughs> Woo! How smooth a chip was that, Lisa? It went really good. <laughs> 
Good well, job, I chipped Trevor. it three inches away for her. Good job, Trav. Well, golfing was my forte, so I was pretty pumped about having to golf. Okay, that's the closest one yet. That's good. It's as close to the as you can get it, not too hard. Goes straight up at it. Yeah, that's perfect. Hopefully. <laughs> Okay. Just pulling up to the golf links. Getting prepared. So there's water. There's a steel. Team must now make their way to the Blue Mountain Adventure Park. Oh yeah, let's go, Blue Mountain. Okay, here we go. Must now make their way to Blue Mountain Adventure Park located north of North Battleford, Saskatchewan to receive their next clue. We uh, hope you aren't afraid of heights. into a very hilly area so I don't like heights I'm excited I don't like heights at all <laughs> like not at all <laughs> and I have to pee and maybe barf a little bit Okay. okay, zipper high ropes, roadblock. A roadblock is a task that only one te team member may perform. Teams must now decide which team member will perform the roadblock. Once you've decided option one, zip. Make your way to the zip line and take in a bird's eye view on this wild but fun ride. Once you've completed the zip line, you will receive your next clue. Option two, high ropes. Make your way to the high ropes course. Once you've completed the course, you'll receive your next clue. Good luck. Right on. Ooh. I'm climbing a rope. How long is the zip line? Uh, I'll be 45 seconds, I guess. Yeah. How long is the high ropes? Uh, it depends how fast you can climb. Zip line. Oh my goodness. This looks this, scary. This looks like so much fun. So much fun. I'm so excited. It looks like we're going to be flying through trees and shit. Welcome to Blue Mountain! Woo! Woo! <laughs> Don't video me trying to calm down!
Son of a bitch, this is higher than I thought. Don't look down. You keep going. Keep going. What are you going to do when you get to the top? Just jump and grab that turkey's butt. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Be careful, but you can do it. You can do it. Can you hold this tight? Got her. We're good to go? Yep. Yep. Next time on The King's Race, Saskatchewan. Oh my god, why am I doing this one? You're okay. Oh, Lord. oh it's a f